welcome back to another edition of Rosie Riveter Snack Time Science. The monarch butterflies are just about to arrive in Mexico after their long journey from Canada. That's over 3,000 miles on those little wings. If that isn't amazing enough, before they go on their journey, they have to transform from a caterpillar to a butterfly. Maybe you've seen a a caterpillar transform into a butterfly at school or at home. It's a pretty amazing process, and it's called metamorphosis. Metamorphosis is a big change. It happens when something like a, an insect or a frog changes from its baby state to its adult state in two or more distinct changes. There are many insects and amphibians, amphibians that go through metamorphosis, like grasshoppers, frogs, and even ladybugs. Butterfly, the stages of a metamorphosis include the egg, the larva, which is the caterpillar itself, the pupa, which is the cocoon or the chrysalis, and the butterfly, the, which is the adult. <laughs> An effect! A caterpillar goes from inside to out, shedding its layers until a butterfly emerges. In fact, if you looked inside of a caterpillar, you'd find tiny little butterfly wings. Join us this week as we explore the amazing parts of butterflies' metamorphosis and migration. Check out the links below to learn more about metamorphosis. We have a special set of genes, not these genes, but the ones that make us unique, make the butterfly's wings patterns and, and, and color form. On Friday, which I'm super excited about, we're going to do a really fun project that ties all of this together about butterflies. It's really cool. So don't miss it. Don't forget to subscribe to Rosie Riveter's YouTube channel for more fun STEM experiments, projects, interviews, and books. Remember, we can do it.